and my sponsor and gratitude is um, mentor or upline Max Deguda. And I'm very grateful for this person because if he didn't introduce me to this business, then I'm still working in the other country until now. Okay. And my background, I was a former overseas Filipino worker. And now I'm doing this business full time. So why I'm doing EC5 or AM Global? Because I would like to become very successful and help many people to become successful as well. And of course, for my family. And what is your goal? So my goal is to expand all over the world and travel anywhere in the world, especially in Africa. That's my goal. And what is your updates and good news? So good news because we are here strong, lively, and healthy, and beautiful. And you know, um, what is the best good news is we are always blessed. Okay, message to everyone. Okay, uh, message for everyone who is here with us. Uh, enjoy the uh, enjoy our uh, topic for today. Absorb and then apply it later on because you know. Training without application is useless. Okay, and since you are in the business already, just keep on learning and keep on learning, 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 and apply what you are learning. All right, so that's all. Then let's go back to Mentor Philip. It's your turn. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. I yes. hear me? Yeah, loud and clear. Okay, how are you? We're all beautiful. <laughs> yeah, this is Mentor Philip from Liberia. Say hi to all my coaches, my partners of EC5. Thank you for the great work. I'm here to listen to the um, the meeting tonight, the training, and I hope that is going to help me to build up my skills uh, in this business so that I also be great and be like one of you, one of you guys up there. Okay, mentor, so why are you doing AIM Global? Oh, no, stop. Yeah, AIM Global, AIM Global International. Yeah, Power why to are the you people. doing this business? Hello? Yes. Go ahead. Yeah, why are you, what makes you decide to join this business? Uh, oh, yes. Go. Yes. Yes. I decided to join this business because, number one, I want to be healthy in my body because I'm taking some of the products. I want to look great. That is number one. Number two, I want to also benefit from the opportunities that this business offer. That is the travel opportunities to also become one of the millionaires like you guys out there. And also be able to share this business, my business plan with other people to on board. Yeah. All right, that's wonderful. So you want to yeah. become more handsome. <laughs> well, of course. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, you got it. So what yeah. is your best message for our partners who are with us and to those people who are not yet a member? Okay, to those that are with us, I my message is for everyone of us to continue. We shouldn't be weak about this business, but we should rather encourage one another. We should keep on moving. It's should be our limit. Keep on talking to the people. Keep on expanding our network, and also ourselves should also consume the product. So we are living testimony to others, and we'll be able to share. And for those that are yet to join us, I encourage everyone to join us because it's a life-changing business. Understand? It's a life-changing business, and if they come on board, we are going to celebrate. Yes, thank you so much, Mentor Philip. 
<laughs> Thank you, Tumi. <laughs> All right. So yeah. tonight we are going to discuss about a uh, very important on how you can grow your network. Okay, so I hope that you will stay there until we finish or until we end this meeting. Okay. I'll so we cannot so. talk to the other because they are actually busy, so they cannot talk. They cannot even hear us. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So you just stay there, Mentor. Thank you very much. Okay, coach. So let's get it started. How about Coach Nilda? Are you there? Okay. So I think they're busy, right? Okay, let's start. My name is Precious Jade. You know, even you didn't question me, I'm going to tell it to you, okay? So, my name is Precious Jade Bustamante from the Philippines. And my mentor is upline uh, Precious Jade Bustamante, my sister. And I am thankful that she uh, she bring us here in important consumerism or economy driver plan. Um, to become prosperous where we are young and to help other people to be with their families while, while they're earning millions, okay? So, what else? Um, I'm doing this business to become a millionaire so a global ambassador and earn one million a month per account. Then my goals is um to hit 50k and then what is my updates and and what what is my update so my updates is we're going to stream today okay so we are ready so kindly send this um link to your international leader so we will pitch them right now and then message to um, our international partners, our message to everyone. Um, let's all learn today and let's all apply what we learn and succeed together, okay? And let's start, coach. Um, I'm going to present to you my um, mentor, speaker, yes. Beautiful mm -hmm. speaker here. Millionaire Circle, Google Ambassador Coach Anita Britos. And Coach Precious Jade Bustamante, the prettiest and youngest millionaire. Okay, let's start. Okay, system plus leadership equals success. Ultimate Eagle International System, the basic of network marketing. Okay, so step one, we need to do this system, okay, in order to have a one, a small group, then it will become a bigger, bolder, stronger group. Okay, step one is you must attend trainings, NECO training, CEDAW training like this one, BMS training here in the Philippines and others. They also conduct um, cell meetings and special trainings, Facebook marketing, level one, two, and three, and enroll on Ultimate Eagle, level one, and level two international elite. Okay, coach? Yes. <laughs> Sabi mo okay. pag ako na, pag ano, pag nauha ka na te. So this training is actually can help you. Bilog bilog this circle, alright. <laughs> so as um coach it said we have the step. Okay, coach, I'm going to continue, but because okay. um, your connection is uh, just like a dance 
stop dance. Okay? Okay, step two is exercises. The five fingers of network more we will die. Coach. Okay, number one is oh wala nga siya. Weak connection coach. I'm back. So as I said, we will die. <laughs> All okay. right, so that's what's gonna happen if you don't do okay. So what are those number one? Prospecting. Okay, so what is prospecting? Uh, people and help converting them into potential customers to current partners okay so all you have to do the moment that you will get your prospect is to have your prospect list all right like any um, notebook so that you can write down your prospects and then your facebook marketing okay what you are going to do in facebook marketing is by adding people okay sending them friend requests and learn the prospecting skills so you should practice what we call form f-o-r-m or uh, f stands for family you should start asking about their family how's the health of their family okay and what else you should ask uh, what's their occupation what they do for a living then after that you will find out what your client or your prospect really need Okay, so before you introduce the business, you should know what the people need. It's either they need the product, so you can introduce our product. If they need some another extra source of income, then you can introduce our marketing plan. Okay, coach? Okay. Right. Number two is inviting. There are three kinds of inviting. The number one is direct approach. Should we reserve for people who know and respect you and for the people that you know are searching for something better? Um, if you know someone or if you have friends or relatives that you want to introduce them to business and you have the authority or they respect you and they will um, follow you, okay? You can directly say to them that I'm expanding my business in your area. Do you want to be part of it? Because I'm doing this uh, a lifetime business and it can help you together with your family. So if you want to become part of us, I'm going to, to tell you the business that I'm doing. And we can be business partner lifetime and you will have all the benefits that I'm getting in this business. Okay. Number two is indirect approach. This approach is the best if your audience may be displeased or may have, um, may have received what you have to say. Okay, if you know someone who will tell that don't invite me in that business, you can bring them to the office. Don't tell them that you're going to the office of our company, but you're going to bring them then um, later, they will notice that, oh, um, the business is okay. I attended the training and I watched the video also. It's very nice business. So I can join because I understand now the business, okay? So that is indirect. We are going to bring them on a meeting, on a group. Um, uh, don't tell them that you're going to bring them on the office. Just tell them that, um, can you be with me? Uh, can you, can you, can we have a coffee date? It's my treat for you. Then you can bring them to the office. Then they will be exposed on our business and they will become inspired. Then number three is super indirect. That that means is 
um, you'll tell the prospect they they aren't the prospect and you're interested in finding out if they know someone else who might benefit from your business. Okay, what are you going to tell them to your people? Okay, to the people that they say, oh, I don't want that business. I don't want to earn quick. I don't MLM business. Um, you're going to tell them that. Do you have uh, no, um, 10 people, 10 to 20 people that they want to earn in our business? Or they want to earn at their house while doing their work in two to four hours daily and they will have another source of income or um, what else? Um, do you know someone who has illnesses that they want to live, um, they want to live more years so they are, they are health conscious and we, we can help them. If you uh, know someone, you can refer me 10 to 20 Facebook names of your friends or their contact number on WhatsApp so I can um, introduce them the business. So you can use that script, okay, to your prospect. So they will, um, they will give you some people because they don't want to join the business but if those people will join then congratulations it's it's your income okay the next okay presentation okay so we have three types of presentation here first is video presentation okay so if you don't know how to present the business very well, if you are just a beginner, okay, we have a lot of videos in YouTube, even in uh, Facebook or from your sponsor, you can ask a video so that you can present it to your clients, okay? Just uh, send the link to your client so that you can watch the video or even if you have downloaded the video, then you can send it directly to your clients, okay? After you ask them that, oh, okay, um, please watch this video and then call me or send me a message after you watch this so that we can um, discuss more about it. Or um, you can also use a script presentation or copy paste. So right now, here in Philippines to other countries, we are actually using either Messenger or WhatsApp, okay? So we have already a script presentation here. It's already ready. So what we are just going to do is just copying and then sending it or even forwarding it to people that we are presenting the business. Okay, that's easy. Or if you use WhatsApp, you can just send it all at once. Okay, that's easier. Or another way is you can call them through video call. Okay, like uh, on WhatsApp or on Messenger so that this person that is asking about the business, then they can... Uh, hear you or watch you while you are talking and explaining about the business. Okay, next. Okay, next is the ABC rules. Uh, All right. Okay. ABC rules, advisor, bridge, client. What is AV rules and how do we do it? First, if you're doing offline inviting, um, after you invite them, you can bring them to the office and meet your mentor, your upline or your crossline. Um, you will go in to text your mentor that, coach, I have a prospect. And then, she is um, very interested in our business and going to the office with her and kindly assist us in order to know the business and that's all, okay. Then you bring your client to the office and then you should um, handshake with your mentor and then your mentor will tell the details and let your client answer the questions. 
So they will have a good communication. And in Facebook marketing, um, we need to make a GC or a in WhatsApp also a GC that you're going to have a video call and then um, you will introduce your mentor, you will introduce your client also and then let them also um, communicate with each other. So be silent, observe only because um, your mentor will do the closing technique and the presentation or um, she will clarify what uh, what is the questions or what would be the answer for the questions of your prospect. And then um, next is you need to use the matching technique or um, for example, your prospect is a teacher. If you know someone who is successful in the business, you can PM them who are teacher also. Coach me, I have a few minutes of your time so you can talk to my client, a teacher also, um, who is first timer in the business. Then the teacher, that, that businessman we have or our friend will share the story they are doing in doing the business as a teacher also. So they will connect. What else? Um, engineer, uh, tuk -tuk driver, what else? Um, what are the uh, miners? Am I right, coach? What is the work of your leaders in Africa or in foreign leaders? Yeah, some of them are teachers. Some of them are working as a construction workers. Some okay. of them are uh, in a gas station, like Manta Jeremiah is working in a gas station. Ah, okay, and wow. Mr. Philip is a teacher. Yeah. Okay, that's great. So if you know someone who is successful in this business that is the same work with your client, then you can bring them also. Aside from your mentor and your upline, okay? So you need to do the ABC rule. So um, you will you will become um less effort because your mentor, the goal of your mentor is to close the deal to help that client and uh to give the all the details that she need or he need, your clients need, and then soon when he pays you will earn even when our mentor did the work that we are doing okay that we need to do even we are part-timers or full-timers so next close deal all right so close deal what is close deal and how we will do it? So this is very important that you should close the deal after you do those number four, like after you do your prospecting, your inviting, and your presentation, okay? You should close the deal. And you know, the moment that you do the ABC rule, 101%, it will, you will close the deal, okay? Because you already introduce your client to a person who is already get a big result, okay? So the moment that you already get the close deal, okay? We have a sample script here of your question, okay? Like let's say for example, um, friend, after reading the presentation, what did you learn? Do you have any questions about the business? So technically, your uh, this friend of yours will don't have any question anymore. Okay. So if ever they will have a question, then you can answer that easily. All right. And what else question? Um, friend, in the reading the presentation, what are the things that you don't like? Probably. They will love the business, 
okay? Because for all those years that I've been presenting the business, everyone that we've been presenting, they all love the business, especially the products and especially our local food plant that they will like it, okay? So they will be saying, no, I like the business, I like the business. So you can proceed with the other question. Uh, Fred, what are the hindrances for you to join the business? Okay, so you can ask this um, question, then they will tell you, oh, think it's about money. <laughs> okay, that is the usually um, a reason or excuses with the other clients so that they cannot join the business. But um, you can also go to the next um, question. Since you like the business presentation I sent to you, your family, then uh, you will join this week or next week. Okay, so you can ask, okay, don't be shy after presenting the business to your client if when are they able to join the business because sometimes the people that you are presenting right now, they might have the money, okay? So what if you already explain everything but you forgot to ask when are they joining when he is already planning to join the business? So it's really important for you to ask when are they joining, okay? So what if they will promise also that, oh, okay, I'm going to join next week. So when they say next week, you should also ask which day, which day on next week. Like let's say, okay, that will be on Monday. If not on Monday, then Tuesday. So you should ask the exact date when they are going to join the business, okay? That's how you close the deal. It's not like, okay, I will join the business. And then you said, okay, without asking when are they joining. So you should really know when exactly they will join. Okay, next. Okay, next. Follow up. How do we do the follow up? A continuation or repetition of something that has already been started or done. And these are the ways we do follow up in this business. Number one, since you close the deal, you know when they will join. And you can update them through, tag them, tag all your business partners when you post business updates on your timeline, okay? Tag them, especially those who are positive in your business and those who join your business or your team. Then send them an encouraging messages like motivational posts, success story, and testimonies. Then number three is sympathize your neighbor, know their stories, give time to video call. Um, you, you should know them deeper, but not into a um relationship or um love life but only a business leader um and extension of your family so know them know how was their family their um siblings their um children's okay then send pictures about your good lifestyle such as food views on your places you went to okay so send them their favorite food or favorite food um give them or share them the culture that we have so they will send also theirs then follow up follow up them on the on the important meeting or activities that we are doing or we are going to do Number one is inform them that we will have next meeting on Wednesday. So see you on Wednesday. Same time, okay? We will also have training. Inform them when is your online academy training will start, okay? So you need to um, give them the next step. After they fill off the form, they give them the ID, the... Um, have body picture for you to edit it and they should be follow up from step one to the next step and next step okay so number three is okay all right number three welcoming them to group 
chat okay so what's inside the group chat that they are you are going to ask them is um they will see all the updates and the good news and the transactions okay that you are doing in your business like let's say for example you purchase a package you receive money then some of your partners get claim their check or purchase any product and everything so the clients okay or your leaders will be updated with that and they will get inspired as well because you are doing a lot of activities with your team okay and what else in your group chat you will also have a training okay or you will add them on a training room okay so aside from uh, updates you can also enroll them to your training or yeah modular training and uh, like they will teach or you will teach them step by step how they get started with the business that they join and what else online academy meeting room okay like right now we are in a meeting room so aside from meeting we also have a um, topic so if you are in your team you can have at least um, like updating or what you are going to talk about like CISO, okay? At least you will have a meeting. And group pages. So in group pages, all of our updates and everything there will be updated as well. So, Coach? Okay. So, we will not talk about that. I will not talk topic. I will not talk about Okay. okay, you're going to do the training in um do the three circles or do the three steps. It um this is a skill that we need to acquire or a system that we need we need to acquire, okay. Okay, the next is we need to do this regularly. For example, um, you are for on your first week, you're only one. Okay, on the first meeting, you're only one. The next meeting, um, you're going to have two leaders or two directs, then you are three, then additional plus four, so you're going to have six leaders, then plus four again. So, so on and so forth, you will become 32, 68, like that, and you will have a big network. So, we need to do the three steps, and then we need to, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go together, let's do it together. Okay, then this one, um, we're going to share to you the culture that we are doing, we're adopting on Ultimate Eagle International. It's a candle culture. We're in the Japanese, um, we use the Japanese system or culture, why they are so disciplined, they are so skilled. Okay, um, in their daily lives. Then, what else? Letter C, clean up, clean as you go, or kaigo. We need to do the clean up um, in order to have a good ambience, okay? When you uh, go to your table, when you go to your working place, if it's clean, it's easy, you can go, go and proceed to your task that you need to be done. But if it's unclean, okay, if it's dirty, then you need to clean it before you start your work so it will become hassle so always clean up always be clean in your um area on your work um on your online hubs and everywhere okay when we go to the office we need to clean everything before we leave so um, we will become good example to our leaders then they will follow them i follow us and you will have a good um, leadership leaders. The next is a range. A range. Ni? Long kaiti. 
Uh, organize and eliminate the unnecessary. Okay, in doing the business, we should um, arrange everything. For example, a, for example, you're in the picture. The computer table is okay. The cabinets is okay. No more papers outside. No more ball pens and everything outside. It was organized. It is clean. So it's okay to work, okay, on that table. So you need to arrange everything in your area, in your closet, in your restroom, in your um, bedroom, in your working area, in your work also. So um, you will have a great, um, you will use your time easily. It won't be wasted, okay? Because when we are arranged, our day will become successful. If you know what you need to do, before you sleep, then tomorrow you won't waste any single time of your day because you list all the things that you need to do and then you, you do it, you make an action to for it to be done, okay? So we need to become arranged, okay? Next, coach. Witness. Okay, so being a you know, um, businessman, it is very important for you to become neat, okay? Like we are pre uh, presenting our products, okay? And this is an international business. And you start talking to people without wearing something neat, then probably, especially when you are talking with the professional people or clients. So you should be meet okay um not on, not only in your um appearance to become meet but also with your words okay be very clean how you talk and how you explain the business it's uh, very important like let's say for example if you are talking to um teacher so teacher is a professional person then you should uh, you should make yourself like um, approachable or how you may call it like clean okay at least you wear something nice and uh, explain the business very well as well so that you will they will get impressed with your presentation and with your looks as well like example in your nails okay as a professional business person it's very important that you are clean like when you are writing for example you should check your nails if it is clean or there will be something black <laughs> in your nails so you should be aware of that because when you are presenting with people okay they might be looking at you like oh this person is not really like a professional businessman if I join this person, they, I don't think she, she or he will bring me into <laughs> some places or something like that. So you should be aware of being me. Okay, coach, what else? Okay, next. Be neat in your, um, in your clothes in your face, in your nails, okay? Be neat, just like Coach Annie. And then discipline. Obey rules and code of behavior. So we need to become disciplined in doing the business. For example, you are working. So use your time wisely. When you it's your free time, then um, use it to prospect or to answer the questions after prospect or your leader, okay? Um, and also discipline on eating, on time of eating, and on time of sleeping, and do the routine, daily routine. If you are part-time leader, so you should do your routine. And if you are full-time leader, you should also do your um, daily routine in order to have a good habit and to have a result. 
So when you are disciplined to yourself, then you will have a good result. But then, um, if you are not, then you won't be productive, okay? There are always two options, okay? A month of pro productivity or a month of full of excuses. So which one do you want to have? Full of productivity you will earn or full of excuses, no more commission, okay? Then we should be disciplined on our actions, on our attitude, and on our work on falling on the line, on uh, following the law, following the rules of the company policy, and everything. Then, ongoing improvement. Kaizo. Improvement, 1% um, daily. Add 1% daily. For example, today, you didn't have a close deal, or you only OPP. You don't have OPPs today, so what are you going to do? So tomorrow, I... Before you sleep today, you should add 30 to 50 people in one Facebook account. And if you have many Facebook, then add also daily. And then talk to them, know them, their story, use the form technique, family occupation, work, um, message, and then OPP them, share the business. Then you can have a close deal when you do presentation. For example, you tomorrow you make a presentation and you have closed deal, then um, on the other other day, you should also make OPPs and um, you should also have closed deal. One closed deal tomorrow, the next, the other day is will become two closed deal or more OPPs, two OPPs, four OPPs, six OPPs. 8 of rupees, 10 of rupees. So, um, involving improvement. If you do improvement on talking, on clothes, your prospect will see it. On your post on your timeline, before you join it, your post is so useless. Then you post now in the business, you post positive posts, products, business. Oh, what are you doing? I'm not... um. I will not get used to what you're posting, okay? So you you improve a lot right now. I want to know what your business is. Okay, that is improvement. In earning, for example, you earn you didn't earn this month or you earn two thousand or one thousand only even what currency it is, then next month you need to earn five thousand, ten thousand, twenty thousand or Whichever you want to hit, okay, but step by step. For example, you must hit 5,000 this month, next month is 10,000, next month is 20,000, 30,000, 40,000, become 100,000, Hall of Fame, and Silver Executive. Okay. Yes, this is the last topic that we are going to conduct. It's top five essential to success. Made by Upline Robert T. De Lavinia, the founder of Ultimate Eagle International, a Hall of Fame of Economy Driver Plan, and Empowered Consumerism. Um, and then he is our mentor and he accumulated the five top five essential characteristics of a top leader or a billionaire millionaire that he is with. Okay, he has a meeting with, so um, we need to apply it to our daily lives, to our business, to become a new person, a new leader, and to have a big group because um, God will only give us a big group, a new leaders that we will um, accompany, we will body if we are ready. Okay, number one is remove excuses okay in joining the business you should remove excuse our excuses because for example our coaches or mentors said to us that we're going to have a meeting wednesday 4 a.m in philippine time and then you say coach i can attend i have a i i need to sleep okay um I don't know 
I, I don't have clothes to wear, okay? What else? There are many excuses that we are saying to our mentors, but then we are, um, we are, what we are doing is the hindrance our success to us. For example, um, we lower the chance that we're going to succeed if we always do the excuses. Um, as we all say, we are all saying is, um, you can make excuses, but you can make money, but you can, you need to remove excuses so you will have commission or you can make your own money, okay? So attend meeting, attend training, apply what you learn, uh, conduct meeting if you have leaders, and then always do follow up, always do the five fingers that we already topic earlier on the system. And then later on, you will have your big group. Okay, and number two is control your emotion. Control your emotion means um, you need to use your good emotions always okay you don't need to become a robot but you need to handle yourself or control your jobs why because sometimes when we are doing the business and someone tells you that your business is calm it is not legit um you won't be successful only people at the top is um will become successful and then you fought with them do you debate with them? Do you think it's a great leadership or not? So here we are telling you that control emotion is one of the necessity that we need to apply on our, on our daily lives. If we're going to fight with them, then we will get their garbages, emotional garbages, okay? So are you a trust can? So they will throw the garbages that they have to you or you don't want to have them. So use your positive emotions such as happiness, excitement, shock, um, feeling blessed, what else? Feeling amazed and everything, okay? Um, always remember that you only you can only control yourselves, not other people. Okay, so if we have um, people who is arguing with us, okay, tell them I understand you, okay? So you can do this business if you want it. And if you don't want it right now, okay, message me if you change your mind. So we can help you and we will become this smarter in this business. Okay, just understand your relatives, your friends, your family. Um, even the strangers um, on what they are seeing because you only see the business. They don't see the benefits. They don't see the how legal the business, how moral the business is, how ethical the business that we are doing. So be proud, be confident, be a leader type. So because if you are going to do that and then your, mentor, uh, your leaders will follow you, then you will be proud. But if you will do bad things, you're going to debate, you will have, you will fought other people, then God won't bless you, okay? The next is improve your communication. There are, there are two types of communication. One is the nonverbal, or we use this on text when we communicate to our prospect, when we type our messages that is non-verbal we don't use words we um we type it okay we don't say it but we type it okay so what we need to do um we don't i we should uh reply fast when someone tell us or ask us about the business um when our mentor says questions or update to us you can set, you can tell them copy noted i understand coach i will follow it okay and what else um when you tell to your prospect that you are going to talk to them at this time then do it okay 
because your prospect will believe you if you are doing what you say. Okay? So walk the talk. Improve your communication. Before you in, you join the business, you are not using your messenger, WhatsApp, emo, Viber, like that. Now you're going to use it because you need to follow up. You need to communicate with your prospect, your mentors, and our business. And then before you are not aware that you need to um, use words, proper words, professional words in sharing the business in talking to other people then you should um become a new person okay um we need to improve our words become professional to know by the words in talking to other people okay reply fast don't argue use understanding okay Use understanding um, attitude to your leaders, to your mentor, to your family, as always. So many blessings will come to us. Number four is be on time every time. So we need to become ahead of time. Okay. For example, we, we have a schedule on the office. We need to become ahead of time 30 minutes, one hour or 30 minutes ahead of time. That our mentor tells us, for example, 4 a.m., 4.30, the link is, the link will be sent, so attend ASAP, as soon as possible. Okay, so um, you are refreshed, you're going, um, you are refreshed, you are confident that I, I, I go ahead, I attend ahead, so I am not hustling to become prepared. For example, you didn't go there ahead of time. You come on the meeting or on the training late. So your sweat is on your face, okay? Um, your hair is messy, okay? You don't. You didn't put the right clothes. You didn't put your um, coat. You didn't put cologne on your clothes then. It's not a good thing. So be ahead of time. Be ahead of time on transaction. Go ahead on the branches that you're going to receive. You're going to receive remittance or everything. Receive a package. Then be ahead of time. Be ahead of time um, every time. Okay? Because time is precious. We only have 24 hours. When, we, when you attend the meeting today, then you can give it back or you can buy another time okay so we only have 24 hours use it wisely use your daily routine to become productive and then um what else uh use your things to do list you can write down things to do list that you need to do so the next thing you will check it after you're done you are done on your checklist then you will say that oh i am productive i use my time i didn't waste my time okay even 30 minutes when you waste your time you can get it get it back okay so um we can choose on this situation one is the wasted time we only um uh, watch on TikTok, YouTube, Likey, Facebook, Facebook videos, K-dramas, movies. That is not, um, those are the things won't help us in doing the business. Or on the second situation is you will sacrifice on watching. You won't watch the TV. You won't watch the videos that are not in line with our business. And then you will do it two to three years to five years, then you will become a millionaire circle, global ambassador, cars achievable, millionaire maker, travel qualifier. Which one do you want? The one that you are doing on your comfort zone, you, earn, you will not earn, you won't change your life or the second situation. Kindly send which um, situation you want to use, the one wasted time or the one valued time okay 
The number five is the last topic. It's protect your integrity. Okay? Um, protect your integrity means we only need once. We only have, we are unique. Our fingerprints are unique. Our tongue print, our eyes is unique. So, um, when we are dealing on money, we need to become transparent. When someone um, mm -hmm. send their remittance to us, then we need to write it down, do the breakdown, send it to them. If they have... Uh, they have changed. Wow. We have changed. When we have changed, then... Go we, we are going to write it down also. We should um, in touch with in breakdown when we say uh, to our leader, when we say a promise, I'm going to put leaders on you, then do it. Don't say it if you won't do it, okay? Because... Other people won't believe on everything that you're going to say if you are not doing what you said. Okay? Be professional. Okay? In this business, we should walk the talk that in this business. So they will respect us. What else? Protect your integrity in... If you borrow or you do loan, you make a loan... On the other things or in, when you join the business you can pay it okay pay it step by step step by step so yeah okay pay it step by step and then message your mentor for example um message the people you borrowed the money is or the things to them okay tell them what date you're going to pay them because sometimes they are shy that they need the money, but they can message to you because they, they know that you're going to pay them. When, but then your money is not fit on the moment or it is locked at the moment. So you're, what are you going to do then? Then this, um, you need to say the status why you, did, you can pay on time. Okay? When you're doing the business, you should um, protect your integrity, pay the loans that you did, uh, do the promises that you gave to the people, um, be transparent on the transactions. When we say we're going to send the package, then send it. We're going to encode someone, then encode it. You're going to send the points of the products then send it on the proper people or the proper area that you're going to send, okay? That are the five essentials that we need to do in doing the business. If we don't do it, um, it will slow the process that we are taking. So we need to apply the system, the Kandu culture, and the top five essentials to success. So we are done, Coach. What can you say? Yes. Thank you so much, Coach, for that very wonderful topic. And I hope that all of you here with us learned a lot today. Okay, so Coach Jay just discussed on how you can create your organization and also how you can handle and manage the moment that you grow your organization. So I hope everybody learned something today. Okay, congratulations. And to our partners who are watching on live, congratulations, because I know, okay, that you've learned something today for you to uh, grow more or develop your organization. So thank you, Coach. Okay, thank you, thank you, Coach Annie. Wow, we are done. Yes, thank you, Lord. Working. Is it working? Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, so my computer is busy now. So again, congratulations, everyone.
Let's take picture before my my computer will will die. <laughs> yeah. So let's take a picture. So let's take picture, 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 picture. Jeremiah, picture. Okay, okay I'm one going more, to say one, more, one more, one more, one more. Happy. How how you will look like when you are earning one million per month? That's how you look like when you are earning one million per month. <laughs> anyway, congratulations, guys. God bless. See you again next week at the same time, the same day. Okay. And we are we are on live. Okay, so if you want to watch this again. You can go to our page so you can watch it over and over. And even me and Coach Jane will be going to uh, upload this video on YouTube. So you can follow us on our yes. channel. Yes, what is your name on your YouTube, Coach Annie? Yeah, you can simply subscribe me on my YouTube channel, Queen Anita Britos. And yours, Coach? My name is Precious Jade Bustamante on um, YouTube, Facebook, and everywhere. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So do the task. I do the uh, topic that we did in order to have a big group in whichever country you are marketing. Okay. So thanks for the time for the leaders on Facebook Live and to those who are Muslim leaders. Um, thank you. Thank you are so that. very disciplined. God bless. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. God bless. Okay, bye bye. Mr. Philip, I will call you on WhatsApp. Goodbye, Coach Jeremiah, Coach Philip, Coach Nella, Coach Rodney. Wow. Let's dance. Okay, to all the viewers on Facebook Live. Jeremiah is dancing. It seems that he's hearing what we are playing. <laughs> 17 viewers on Facebook. Wow. Earlier 20 plus. Shout out to my sweet Yaya. Um, it's Marilu C. Manla. Coach Jamnik Albarico from Laguna. Jamila Sigondo ang from Saudi. Yeah. Congrats. Hindi pa siya nagsasaya. Ikaw, nag-ing-ing yung kanta. Hindi ka nagsasaya. Hala na yan. Ay, nag-alaw ko po ba? Ah, okay. Okay. Bye-bye. God bless. I'm going to end this live in 3, 2, 1. Goodbye. Goodbye, coach. Kapag pinatay ko, sabihin niya, ano?